Thank you for coming by Tori Magoo 44. Hang on. What is today? It's the 9th of July. Why this me Anyway, I got to turn it off for now, but thank you for coming by my site. Um, it is the 9th of July, 2013. And uh, what can I say? It's summertime. I'm happy it is. There's a lot of stuff happening regarding Scientology that is just unbelievable. In a good way for us, a very bad way for them. Um, a couple of the things, Will Smith's school closed after a long and I guess a strong fight. But anyway, he closed it. We'll see what happens on that. Um, David Miscavige's sister got arrested for, I think, drunk driving or something awful. I know I read it, but I forget it now. But anyway, she it's on the Internet. You can type it in there. Way to go, DM. I mean, he's lost pretty much all of his family, his dad, his brother, his niece. You know, Je Jenna wrote the great book, uh, Beyond Belief. Anyway, uh, his wife is, I think, locked up in Lake Arrowhead. So, you know, way to go, David Miscavige. You're really, really showing how great Scientology is, how they really, really expand. I love the way he's like, we're always expanding, right? But his family's like contracting like mad. Um, but, and then, uh, what was the other one? Oh, yeah. I'm going to put a link in this for um, good old Moxon. There's a guy named... Um, Kendrick Moxon, who is like one of the sleazebag attorneys for the Church of Scientology. And uh, the Angry Gay Pope made a website for Kendrick Moxon. And I'm going to put it in here. And Moxon, this is like really karma for you. Because you have slimed a lot of us and kept libel and lies. and You know, this isn't lies. These are facts about you. So, but you deserve it. You really do. So anyway, this today, what I'm going to be talking about actually is something that I have deeply in my heart. It's why I speak out. It's because of the abuses the Church of Scientology does to parents. And one of my dear friends tried to send their children a gift. That's all. Just some nice, wonderful things. And they sent it back. And this is what I'm speaking about. Scientology denies parents their ability to communicate with children. And that is so not okay. It is so non-religious. It is creepy beyond words. And it is why I continue to speak out. And I, I can't say it enough. If you're a Scientologist in and you're listening to this, you need to get out of that creepy organization. They are not expanding with people. They are expanding with buildings. Okay. All right. So they've got buildings. They don't have people. The people are diminishing daily. They're coming out. We're meeting them. We're talking to them on a daily basis. And you should too, you because they're taking your money. And I'm talking to my friends, people that I knew, that I loved, and I hate that you are wasting your life with this sleazeball organization. You have to start thinking, even if you're mad at me, think about all the other people that have left the Church of Scientology. And why? Why did they leave? I mean, what happened? At least have a little bit of curiosity and adventure, a spirit of adventure and freedom. And that's what you got into Scientology for. They very quickly chipped it away to now you're kind of locked in. That's why I call it the Truman Show. That's what it is. Everything's like, good morning, good afternoon. Good evening. Everything looks so great, but is it really great? No. And we know from talking to people that leave. So, and just things like I just mentioned, which are just a few things. So I'm going to put some links in here for you guys to look at. And uh, as far as the families, David Miscavige, I cannot say it enough. Stop hurting families. Let children talk to their parents. It is not okay that you pretend you're a religion when nothing could be farther from the truth. You are a flat out business and soon your tax exemption may change. It may. I'm just saying it may. So keep your ears open. Thank you to everyone who helps expose the insidious cult of Scientology. I greatly appreciate it. I love you all. Have a wonderful summer and uh, there you go. Bye-bye.